Hello, my friends in YouTube land. My name is Daryl. Yes, that's right. It, it, it is a girl's name. And um, I love to shop at the Seattle Goodwill outlet, which is also known as the bins. And what I love to do as an avid lover of fashion my whole life and textiles is uh, take a trip to the bins and then mix and match all the pieces that I got that particular day and put some things together and show you what they look like. Now, you know, I'm obviously um, of a certain age. And so I really um, try to kind of have a balance between what is trendy out there and what is what is styling. And, and so to style things in... A contemporary way but in a way that hopefully works a little bit um, for a person of my advanced years <laughs> um, so we're getting a little bit glam right at the moment um, I got a lot of dresses this trip and so it's gonna be really fun to show you these um, this is a top by Topshop and I've paired it up with a skirt that is by junior brand XOXO right and but i liked it because it's got um slits at both sides whoop and i'm gonna move my chair so i can get back here and hopefully not kill myself <laughs> this is the stuff i got at the bins yesterday oh, including the suitcase Anyway, I don't know that I would wear this in this particular combination, um, but it's uh, this really was the, the best uh, party top to wear with the sparkly skirt. <laughs> so um, I think this would be cute with something, you know, kind of cropped, more like that. Oh, looks better already. <laughs> okay. This very short dress <laughs> um, is from Naked Zebra, and um, I have to say it's a little bit on the junior side for me, um, but I am liking mini dresses and short dresses this year. Um, I, uh, I am. <laughs> and this one, though, is just, you know, I wore dresses this length when I was younger. Anyway, it might be doable with the blazer over it. I just think for me that it's showing a little bit too much skin. Um, so, but it's pretty cute. Um, these run about $59. Uh, sadly, fall is on the way and it's time to start looking at sweaters. I love this. This is from Truly Madly Deeply an open cardigan with a ribbed knit kind of a blushy nude color and I've paired it up with this um, I've kind of I'm turning it up a little bit because I'm liking to show a little bit of skin when you're so covered up here this is J crew and this is part of their reimagined uh, line which I imagine that they take the uh, pieces that have been returned back in from people and this is so soft I I had to look at the tag to see what was going on with it because it is just killer soft um, so it's like my new favorite tank top and then this was one of the best things I got of the whole trip and um, I'm undecided right now whether I want to um, cut them off a little further or just roll them up or just wear them the way they are. But what they are is AMO um, button fly shorts in uh, the, the lover boy. And they have button fly and a high rise waist. And I just, I love them. I like them in all of the iterations. They make another version of them that are a little shorter. I'm liking them long. Um, they have 200 plus price point. And um, so they are uh, 
uh, my new favorite cutoffs. A couple other pieces I got, and I was just saddened that this didn't fit. Look, this is Jenny Yu, Y O O, and uh, it's a couple hundred dollars. And this is also carried at Anthropology in their uh, uh, BDHN department. And I have the perfect skirt that goes with it, but I'm gonna try and pair it up with something else. So hang tight and watch for that. Um, I got a few uh, household items. <laughs> These are bamboo placemats. Every home patio needs that. <laughs> and then this is a pillow sham. And I got this uh, to go in my new gray painted living room. So It just adds a little bit of texture and kind of a beachy feel. Another thing, this actually fits me, but um, I'm going to spare you because I'd probably scare you right off. <laughs> this is um, it's by Bikini Lab. Pretty cute. It's just, um, uh, they run on Amazon between uh, $23 and $60. And another metallic swimsuit. And I just grabbed these because I liked them. I got four pieces. And it turns out that they're from Shine. Um, see, here we go. Here's the look. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Woo! Unfortunately, they are an extra large. Um, I did take the sewing machine to these bottoms. I think it's this pair, one of the pairs, and um, took them in um, so that they actually fit. <laughs> so they're smaller now. So we'll see if this is, re is wearable. I'm not sure, but I thought it went so good with this awesome blouse. I did find this online and was able to get a comp. It's $40 from some, some place I've never heard of. <laughs> um, excellent, perfect shape. And I'm not really a fan of leopard print, but I can do this. It's pink. <laughs> So on with the clothes and the styling how-tos. <laughs> so this beautiful dress, this is from Joanna Barashi. And um, I believe it was carried at the um, um, Anthropology wedding site, which is BHDN. Yeah, let me show you this. Isn't that pretty? It's the back. I hope I hid where I didn't get the zipper all the way up. <laughs> I just think this is just gorgeous. The detailing through here. And, uh, just has summer wedding guest written all over it. Here we are with a free people piece. I knew right away that this that's what this was because I own it already in green. <laughs> but I love it, especially in gray. And it's also a size smaller, which I like better as well. This is a small. And you can see it's a generous fit meant to be oversized. And it's just slightly off the shoulder. And I've paired it up so you can see how long that is like this. Let's wish it up. Anyway, here's these cute shorts. And these are super because they are a high rise. They're a little biggish. 
I guess, but I think they're um, pretty old and they're from St. John's Bay, which I believe is a Penny's brand. And, uh, but I do like them a lot because of the, the utility pockets. And I just think they're right on trend. Again, right in, on style, in style. And maybe they're newer, no, I don't know. We don't have a Penny's here anymore. So, <laughs> I don't know. Maybe they're carried somewhere else. And a V-neck t-shirt. This is from Sanctuary. Okay, so now I had to show you this with um, the sweater over it because um, I don't think it's quite appropriate to just show all of the bits here, but I have to show you this top. This is from um, uh, For Love and Lovin' Skinny Skivvies. And as you can see, it's a fantastic, just sparkly piece. And I got it kind of pulled up a little bit so that it lays the way it's supposed to. But see, here we go. So you can see how it matches the pants, which are from Express. And they have... Um, a crystal tuxedo stripe running down the side. So pretty cute. I'm going to try this with another top over it and we'll see how that works. Okay, I think this works a little bit better for um, someone of my age. <laughs> well, no, someone of my modesty. <laughs> um, this top is from an Italian brand. It's Giada Forte. And so you can just see the the um, glittery thing kind of peeking through. So I think I'm okay with that. And um, this is just a gorgeous top. I couldn't get a good comp on it. Um, but uh, they sell this brand on the Real Real. And so it's got a pretty uh, lovely price tag on it, I'm sure. And uh, I'm going to try and pair this up with a skirt that I got. And, you know, I don't ever put this stuff all together beforehand. And so if it looks hideous, I'm so sorry. <laughs> all right. So I had to try something else with the skirt. And uh, I didn't want anything too fussy. And so I've gone with this crop t-shirt. The t-shirt is from Splendid. And um, the skirt is from cashmere and cupcakes and it has about a hundred fifty dollar retail and uh, I think this is doable right here let me show you okay this is an interesting matchup <laughs> So let me show you what I've got here going. This is a, just a gorgeous cami, don't you think? Now, I am wearing it as a cami. It's possible that it is a bra. Um, quite possible, as a matter of fact. Um, but I think it makes an awesome cami. The lace is so beautiful. It's got lots of coverage. And I've paired it up with this pair of Caslon tensile shorts that desperately need to be ironed. <laughs> so they're going to get popped in the washing machine and, um, and then I'll lay them flat and then see how much ironing they need since I am not one to really do a lot of the ironing stuff. And I thought it would look cute again with this, this Giada Forte, um, sheer silk top. So let's see how this goes. So I like it out. I can't see that well on my phone. It's itty bitty. So, um, but I think if we do a, a half tuck with it, see it's pretty baggy, baggy stuff going on here. So let's pull it in a bit.
I don't know. I'm thinking you could knot it or you could do something fun with it. Who knows? Let's see. That's what all of this styling stuff is, is just kind of playing around, huh? This is cuter. I'd wear this. You betcha. Cute shorts from one of my favorite uh, shorts makers. This is from Old Navy. I don't know why it is, but they do a really nice job on shorts. They always fit me really the way I expect them to fit. These are a linen blend and they have nice deep um, utility pockets, elastic around the waist and a drawstring. And again, the cropped splendid top. So this is a nice pairing. Um, this is another cami. Um, and um, I'll show you the back because it's pretty awesome. But I, I'm going to show you another way that you can wear this sweater as well. The, the sweater is cashmere and it's from Soft Surroundings. And um, I just kept the shorts on. So I, I wouldn't wear this with the shorts. But um, so beautiful golden cashmere. Um, it has about a $129 price tag. And, um, and I, I like the, um, um, idea of turning the sweater around and tying it in back. So let's see how that works. <laughs> Pretty tricky, huh? So this has a hole in the front here that I need to mend. Um, but you know it's pretty easy see here it is pretty easy to mend cashmere I've said this before it's like a fence in my opinion <laughs> you don't replace it you mend it <laughs> so let's see how this works it might be totally hideous <laughs> but <laughs> so here's the front which I think is fine. Okay, and then let's see what the back looks like. So I kept the cami on because this is what I liked was the how strappy it was. And I kind of like the idea of having this um, open back with the tie on the cashmere. So I don't know if it works because I can't see it, but I'll find it when I edit. <laughs> I'll go, oh no. <laughs> this is a gorgeous dress and it probably ran around $500. It's from Philip Lim 3.1. And um, it's basically a Grecian cut here. And I'd have to check as to whether it was... Uh, silk or cotton it might be a silk and cotton blend but i just love this dress i think it's timeless and let's put some heels on with it all right isn't this pretty hopefully you can see the um the fabric here and what's going on with the waist and here we go I don't think it's sheer I guess we'll find out won't we <laughs> I adore this dress um, it doesn't have a label on it and so I don't know where it came from um, but uh, it is just so cute on so many levels. So let me show you this. It's got a tiered hem. Whoop, lots of fabric through here. This cute square neckline and uh, can wear the, uh, wear it off the shoulder if you like. 
and then the back. I'm not sure what it looks like, right? Put these up. Uh, zipper back. So it just shows just a sliver of skin. I just love it. And I opted to keep my hair pulled up just so that I can have this nice expanse of skin going through here. But we're going to take it down now. Get wild. No. <laughs> This is a dress from Jarbo, and it's just probably a size or two, <laughs> too small. <laughs> but I wanted to show it to you, and I wanted to show it to you with this cute bag. Silk. And as you can see, it's got sort of an inverted shape here or uh, what they used to call a the uh, uh, sack dress um, so it's a little small right through here otherwise I could probably get away with it and um, I've paired it up with this purse that I actually got yesterday um, but I just thought it went so well with it um, I will tell you about this uh, when I do my next video but isn't that sweet it's like summer personified. It's vintage. So a couple more pieces. And uh, let me show you this skirt. I was going to put it on because this is what goes with the Jenny U sweater. Um, and the skirt actually fits me. The sweater um, is too small in the sleeves. But this is from Tadashi Soji. And um, it's got kind of a, it's a taffeta with sort of a mermaid fit. Um, it comes up high on the waist. And I really didn't have an appropriate top to put it on with. This retails for about $400. So I'm sure that I will find a place in time to wear it. At least I hope so. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> And a pair of leggings. These are from Gap Fit. And I haven't tried them on, but I'm kind of excited to because they've got just a really nice fabrication. And um, these are the Gap Fit Sculpt Revolution in purple. Uh, Next. <laughs> All right, so here we are. And I debated about this dress because I thought, oh, it's just a like a Forever 21 kind of piece. Until I found it online. And it's from a brand that's called House of CB. And uh, it has a $195 retail. And it's, a <laughs> it's warm in here. <laughs> And it is called the Ella Organza Mesh Mini. And I like this so much. It may go, I wouldn't wear this stuff around home. You know, I might run into someone I know. <laughs> but I will take it on vacation. <laughs> I don't know really what that means. <laughs> so here. So I am rather enamored of it. I just, it may be far too young for me, but you know, who's to say? Let's see what the back looks like. It's a dancing dress. <laughs> I have to say, it's really comfortable, too, once you get it on. <laughs> Boy, I'm going to have to do some major editing on this video. <laughs> okay, so this is another piece that needs to be ironed badly. But this is from Anthropology. The brand is Maeve. 
And it's just a rayon piece with roll tab sleeves. Um, I'm keeping them long because I'm kind of going with the sort of 70s vibe here. Um, the pants are from Sanctuary. And they are a pretty current style as they're all over the place on the web. Um, the boot cut leg here. And I just think this is cute, like uh, with the top tied up. Um, these are a Ponty knit, so they're really stretchy and uh, kind of cute. So there you have it, my friends. That's it for this trip to the bins. Um, my receipt is telling me that I spent $46 and that included tax. And that was at that dastardly $1.89 a pound. How dare they raise the prices. Um, and that included rounding up. <laughs> just in case you wondered so um that's it for this time my my friends and i've got oh gosh a bunch more to bring you so uh, keep tuned subscribe watch my other videos please i'm having a very discouraging august slump so <laughs> still good stuff see you later